Before we get into the video today, I just want to give a quick shout out to one of our sponsors, Gnostic TV. Gnostic TV is ancient wisdom reimagined. This is a Netflix for those who are spiritually curious and want a place to go where there is no censorship. I personally am doing a whole series on Gnostic TV called The Esoteric Explorer, where I am providing exclusive content to Gnostic. Gnostic TV is a host to all sorts of different content creators, many of whom are your old favorites. If you would like to check out Gnostic TV, there is a link down in the description box below. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Esoteric Atlanta. I am joined today, as always, with my friend Jay. How you doing today, Jay? Hi. What's happening? How are you? I'm good. You're down in Florida. I, I can see in the background. I always get so jealous of you Floridians. <laughs> yes, you should be jealous. It's really nice here. I'm not going to be ashamed to say it. <laughs> living your best life. Well, God, I mean, I you're living your best life. And I think, you know, we were kind of chit-chatting about what we were going to talk about in our video today. But you know, we were saying, like, sadly, in, in one reality on our planet, we're going through a huge recession. We know that they've changed the definition of recession. And we're actually kind of in the same situation we were from what I understand with the Great Depression, if that makes people feel a little bit better about, you know, the, your financial situation right now. But, you know, as always, we, 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 we are trying to figure out ways to help people live their best lives, as I was saying, because you didn't come here just to live your best life the last 10 years of your life, right? Like you, you should be living in your, in your, in your dharma and your abundance even in a recession and so you've got this idea to really help people who are kind of starting their new ventures their new businesses and i'm just going to hand it off to you because i think it's a brilliant idea to help people out yeah thank you and you know who thought about that spend the last 10 years of your life living your dharma i mean like like who made that rule up right you know what i mean that guys <laughs> it's gonna reinvent that so all right so um Everybody, thanks again for always uh, hanging out here uh, and let me share this information with you. But what we're really wanting to do is to really, you know, we've been on an effort, really, Bryce, as you know, to really help people find ways to prosper and break through the cycles and break the or, or at least be able to work within the parameters of the matrix, however you describe all of that. Um, so what we're doing, Bryce and I, is we're actually putting together these events, okay? These events are going to consist of different speakers that have a real solid message to share. And this is for those of you who are, okay, you got... Uh, you got services that you want to get out to the world. You got a show you want to get out to the world. You got products and things you want to get out to the world. And and you're all and the reason we're doing this is because we see a lot of the people that a lot of these events, if you would, Bryce being held, and you know they're like they're like ten hour events, six hour events, and they have twenty thirty people. But this what happens is a lot of times the feedback we get is the speaker gets lost in the middle of all that. You're, you're, it's the bookends that actually do all right. The one in the beginning and the one at the end. Everybody else in the middle generally gets lost. So this is really a, um, a, a solution to that kind of scenario because in principle, Bryce, that whole scenario of, well, you know what? 20, 30 people getting together, 20, 30 businesses getting together and collectively promoting a scenario to their audiences is a really good thing. The problem is nobody sits there for six hours they just don't you know so the way we're doing it is we're actually everybody uh this is really exciting we're actually going to be doing it in a way where each speaker that comes on is going to have their own segment within there so each one will be independently marketed each one will be independently recognized so it won't be like okay you have to you have to go like an hour in to know when the next one's coming in you'll be able to see them and the way it'll also be able to show is that if you ever want to go in the in in the future to, to watch any one spe uh, speaker individually it'll be they'll be able to do that too so not only are they going to have their own identification if you would with inside the event they're also going to be marketed very heavily through our social media so we're super excited about that as an individual which is good so we get to really highlight their businesses so who would be a perfect candidate let's say somebody thinks you know i might want to participate in a summit but i don't know if i'm right for this it can be anything really right like what what would be a perfect candidate of someone to participate in the summit to be a speaker at this summit to be able to market themselves through the summit 
uh, people who have these programs, Bryce, you know what I mean? Like they're, they're coaching programs, if you would. And, um, they're, they're, uh, uh people who have sessions that they want to do mainly those people right there, I would say are big candidates. Those are the ones we see a lot of some people that also have products that they want to promote. But I would say the biggest person is if you got a, if you got a message and you need to take someone through a, a multiple session journey, i.e. a program, that's a really good candidate for these kind of events because this will give you the opportunity amongst 20 other people that are going to be sharing 20 up to 20 other audiences to share your message out there. You know, so you're cross-promoting with other yeah, people. I'm cross-promoting. Yeah. yeah, but again, the difference being on this one is we're going to individualize the way the speaker's sectioned out. Right. So it's not going to be so much, like I said, just one long seminar. You know, right. so at, they, at any point in time, they can just go to the speaker when they share it with their audience. They can just promote their segment of the of the event if they want to. Yeah, but the other people are bringing in. Uh, yeah, so they can like yeah. click on different videos to see different yeah. and other people are. Yeah, because that's I mean, that's such a big thing. I mean, we do that on YouTube anyway. We all cross promote with each other and, and share each other's channels and stuff. So that's a really great way to get momentum because it is hard right that's the hardest thing is when you first start a business or a, tr a training whatever it is to get your to get the marketing out there to let people know that you're actually there and you're actually available to, to uh, for services so so we've got uh, basically two groups here we have people who want to present their product their business and then people who want to watch the video right. that watch the, the summit so yeah. um I, is there anything you want to add before we tell our our, uh, our listeners how to get involved in this? Yeah, absolutely. I want to let everybody know we covered all bases. We covered the base from the speaker so the speaker could feel like, hey, this is my own party. I get to do what I want to do and I don't feel lost in the shuffle. And yeah. we also covered the fact for the the viewer who's going to watch it so they can easily go to wherever they want because if they like, they can go to whoever they're attracted to because each individual speaker is going to have Bryce their own section so you'll be able to read about each speaker independently and say i like just that person maybe you like whatever maybe you like the whole thing we don't know it's up to you, you yeah know, it's like you online shopping so you don't have to sit online for the whole shopping. you don't have to sit for the whole play you can just yeah. select the acts that you want to see and you might if you right. go to the summit or go online to the summit you might see um somebody that you you're you never knew was there but you're interested in so you're going to click and watch them too which is the cross promotion with yeah. other yeah Hundred percent, and you know it's it's so important that people get, uh, they they get an aspect of as we're trying to always do through different variances, and is really just understand the ways to live life here. So you got to make it easy for people, right? You got to make it so it doesn't doesn't feel like, oh my god, more overwhelming. Oh my god, another lesson plan. Oh my god, another this. It's just, you know what I mean? It, it can't be like that. I mean, we don't live in that world anymore. We live in the world like you know what can we do to make it easier so well, this is what this whole so we're going to make it very easy for all parties concerned on this so we're uh, you know again as always we're super excited to do this in collaboration with you, you yeah know. well I, i'm all about people to, it, and it's hard I, I will i will admit like i i you know it's hard to change our changing your pattern of thought changing changing your programming is hard to do like i, I you know there's no you know it's it's like quitting smoking or quitting sugar like it's hard to change but it changes possible and we've learned right. you know so many people in the world right now think someone's going to come save them but i think we know on this channel especially especially that that's not the case you have to save yourself and it's so we're you know ram das says we're all just walking each other home so yeah that that's the biggest thing is like there's all these opportunities to make money to make a living doing things that you love to do and as my grandfather used to say if you do what you love you'll, you'll never work a day in your life and that's more in align with alignment with dharma and right. and so for a lot of people i know there's so many people watching right now that just really want that they want to take that plunge and change their lives and change what they do with their lives every single day because that's really what it comes down to right it's like what you're doing with your life every uh -huh. single day 100 percent, yeah. and you know a lot of this is like it, it look I, i'll be the first to say this it doesn't matter whose course class whatever you attend if your mindset's not right yeah it, it doesn't you you know it's it's all of this is going to be really we're going to be taking a very big charge on helping you reframe your your you know there's two sides of the brain there's yeah. the, the two sets of brains there's a conscious and the subconscious right really understanding right. how to use the because we use the conscious one that's our that's our oh should i shouldn't i why is this red well is it red or you know what i mean that's a rational thing versus the the subconscious is the one that makes dreams come true so right. we have to be able to fill that 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 coffer, if you would, of the subconscious, so our dreams can come true. So a lot of this is going to be along the lines of really understanding, like when people see 
a lot of paths being clear, if you would, Bryce, then then they can start to then it, it helps them to start to reprogram, you know, their thought process. Yeah. And they don't want to go into something and be like, oh, my gosh, I, well, I'll give it a shot or I'm going to try this, but I'll be part of something. No, you know, this is your unique party. You program it. This is your time to be abundant. I mean, we're in, you know, I don't know. I mean, there's got to be something to it because it's been done all these years where we're in the year of a dragon. It's an abundance year. It's an eight. So whatever that means to whoever that means to, there's enough people saying it. So there's got to be something to it. <laughs> you know right. what I mean? There's energy, right? right? You know? Well, and so, it's, it's again, it's about, you know, it's, it's the value that you have as a human being. I think that we've been programmed to think that our value only lies in what we can produce for someone else, like how right. good of an employee we are. And, and although that is important to an extent to be able to work in a community, at what point do you realize my value doesn't lie outside of myself? It lies within myself. And if I can be valuable to myself, you know, and, and so many times when you're actually doing what you love, you become a happier person and therefore your vibration rises and then that attracts higher vibration as well right so uh, yeah it is, it is totally a reprogramming it is totally and again i, I want to I just reiterate to our viewers i know it, i we know that's hard to do we know it's it's really hard to break a habit and to form a new habit but it's possible and that friction that happens or if you're watching this and this is resonating with you that friction is is necessary in order to get you to actually you know, that's people often ask Jay, they're like, they're like, if God exists, why does he allow the devil to roam free? And it's like, because if you were comfortable, you would never refine yourself, right? If you were comfortable, you would never have to seek a course correction. And in seeking that course correction and doing things like this summit, you know, putting yourself out there, you will learn more about yourself and have a more fulfilling life than just following the, the pattern that you've been programmed to follow or to believe about yourself, you know? Yeah. It really yeah. is. And, you know, just think about like we think often from a very multidimensional experience and, you know, we we allow for the fact that there's different versions of us going on at different times, because, again, why not? <laughs> you know what right. I mean? And so so if it's uh, if it is possible out there, then we allow for that fact. So, you know, if we can if we can take that on and, and really embrace that and realize that whatever our thoughts are, it's already being done right at the second. And then, you know, just now start to find out who your future self is at doing it and bring it together, bring it home and apply it in this particular version of you. Don't think that a lot. There's a theory of like, well, it's done in another lifetime, but that doesn't mean anything. You want it in where you're sitting. You this one. Yeah, you want exactly. It in one That's great now. that you got another version doing it somewhere else, but you want yeah. it in where you're at where you can touch and feel yourself. That's what this is about. Bring it home to you. This you is know? the experience. And, and yeah. you're right. I heard somebody say on a spiritual channel the other day, like, every every reality of you exists somewhere like the homeless version of you and the millionaire version of you exist and where you go depends on what wh what your pattern of thought is right so okay. if you don't want to go the homeless you gotta you gotta change and re rewire and that's where you become the creator and that's where you hold your own soul your own dharma within your own hands and and yeah i'm big on that too it's it's the here and the now it's not the then and there or the future it's the what the here and the now and that's another thing i get too a lot jay like i have people comment and say oh but i'm in my 70s oh and my my answer is if you're still breathing then you still have life to live yeah, you do. You do. And, and that's, all, that's, you know, I don't even really, me and April were talking about it. We don't even really count our age as much anymore. Celebrate. Why? I mean, like, it's like, why put a time talk or t a ticker on something that is inevitable anyway? So why right. this, why always be reminded of that? And I'm right. not saying anything like that. Look, maybe like Santa Claus until you're a kid, you know, celebrate it. But just like from there on out, start to think about life very pragmatically. I mean, we don't have to. Um, one year more and one year more, you know, why don't you just think about it very differently? You know? Yeah. It's uh, I, I saw the greatest thing. Somebody said, instead of saying I'm 41 years old, I'm going to say I'm on level 41. I'm right. just on level 41. Like, so that means, you know, more. And, and if you are still breathing and that's what drives me crazy, Jay is, is I think so many people are so focused on death that they forget to actually live. Right. You are here to live. Yeah. Mushrooms will help with that. <laughs> Right. I mean, right. I mean, it does. It gives you a different perspective. You know, yeah. I, I don't know. I always tell people, I'm like, look, you know, if you are a business person, you need to see life through a different set of lenses. I mean, consider plant medicine. I mean, I know it's up to you. You know, you'll do your thing, but I, I do it. Yeah. 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 I will tell you, like things like that have really had a different perspective on my concept of death and life and mm -hmm. just how to be able to understand things with no judgment and 
really understand the power of everybody else's journey, you know? I will say for those that are still kind of stuck in the naysay of like age, my my late my my father, my grand my father's father, he's now passed away, but he had a near death experience when he was in his mid forties. And it absolutely changed him. Like it changed him. And you hear that with people who have near death experiences. They are absolutely like changed. They book they they come out a different person because they see things, they don't fear death anymore. And so once that fear of death goes away, they're invincible. And and I'm sorry if it's loud, you guys, but my grandfather used to um he used after he had his experience, it took him a couple of years to recover from the heart issue that caused him to have it. But then he basically became unstoppable. He ended up in his 50s onward, he ended up becoming a multimillionaire because wow. he had no fear anymore. Because the worst possible thing that can that we think can happen to us is death. But once you've seen the death and it's nothing to fear, you become invincible. And he became more loving as a person. He became more generous as a person. He became more, um, even when my boyfriend met him before he died, died for the final time, he was like, there's just a wisdom about him. And so hopefully that... Well, for, for those of you who are, who are stuck in that belief system of this is the age of retirement, I'm too old for this, I'm too old for that, I will say there's lists out there of people who didn't write their first novel until they were like 55 years old. What is it? Vera Wang didn't make her first designer dress until she was like 50 or something. It's never as long as you are breathing you can change as long as you are breathing you can bring life back into you at 41 years old i feel like i look younger at 41 than i did at 30 you know and so but that's a lot of choices that i've made in my life 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 choices but you know age really ain't nothing but a number unless it's kids we're, we're not even gonna, there's it's kids it's kids but as far as as far as adults right aging nothing but a number and so you can you can either look at your age as a hindrance or you can look at your age as the fact that you now have wisdom that can guide you to a different a different path. So, all right. So, Jay, like if people want to participate in this, what's the next step for them? Well, you know, the proverbial text Jay Bryce event. Yes. <laughs> what I would do, text Jay Bryce event 321-216-8047. And then let's just get in the chat. Tell, tell me what you're wanting to get out there. Tell me what you want to explore. And then we'll, we'll go through the journey of what it's going to look like. You know, and and how this can really benefit. We're excited about it. We really feel like this is a big breakthrough of getting the collective uh, of the right vibrational matches together to be able to really get out there, get their works out there, um, get the right kind of soul tribe they're looking for, Bryce. Get the prosperity they're looking for. I mean, you know, it's really pretty. It's got such a great vibe and um, resonance behind it. So I appreciate as always. You know, you bring me into your world to talk about. Absolutely. It. So guys, all that that number, Jay's phone number will be down. My my jail, my uh, my if I ever need to get bailed out of jail number will be down in the in the description box below. So just text Bryce event you said to yep. the number down in the description box below guys and that is Jay's actual number. So he will get back to you and figure out what's best for you and what 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 we can do to serve you and to help you with this. And um you guys I just want to take a moment with Jay here. I I was telling you off camera that I had somebody um very very highly compliment Gnostic TV. And Jay, I know we didn't talk about this but can you can we share will you share the new layout of Gnostic TV for us? Yeah, 100%. Our, uh, I love it. So check this out everybody. We made it very easy. And I think I got some background noise here too, but that's all good. We can all get through it. But um, but here you go. So like, if you go to Gnostic TV, Gnostic TV broadcasters right here, here are the different shows. You simply click on the people that you want right here. Bryce, you got two shows on here. And it, and it really it really comes on here. And then there's also new releases, the different uh, sections within here, like whatever you're drawn to. It's super easy to watch, just like very much like a YouTube. You just click and you... You play so this is very much going to expand it we're going to have a plant medicine called the medicine garden that's coming oh, cool. right there yeah yeah so there's some really some exciting stuff here but check this out price we've actually got i will show you right here so this right here is if you want to see who's on here so you see us you see bryce everybody you click see all here and you will see the different channels that are already on here that, that is amazing on. yeah and, I, and you somebody yeah, somebody was giving such compliments to Gnostic yesterday, just yesterday, and I um, I actually just submitted, you guys, I just submitted a new video for the Esoteric Explorer series literally like 10 minutes before I signed on with Jay. 
Um, and I, I even say in this episode that it's so refreshing to be able to be on a really on a legit platform where I don't have to worry about what I say, where I right. can speak the truth in these deep because I do a lot of deep dives. And sometimes on YouTube, it's difficult because I have to talk around things sometimes. And so it's really great to be able to just kind of go there and to really look at the information. And um, and with the esoteric health and wellness uh, series, I was telling you, Jay, uh, last a couple days ago, I did a, about an, a little over an hour video where I talked about my experience with health and what I learned growing up with the digestion problems and going to India, what I learned and how on Gnostic TV, I'm able to kind of put that into different videos in segments so that you guys can take that information and hopefully better yourself as well um, yeah. through this um, this ancient and for ancient re ancient wisdom reimagined, right? Like wisdom reimagined. Very and old know, information. This, well, and this is where the uh, this is where the events are going to be hosted too. So to put it in perspective, like the dynamics of it when we do the event when it's all done, we're looking for. So basically, in the event is that um, we're going to be onboarding the speakers, if you would, throughout this month of April. And then March is where we're, or excuse me, May, we're going to start to really snap everything together. So it'll be, it'll be going uh, uh, live and up and running in May. So it'll, and it'll be hosted here on Gnostic too. That's awesome. And I do want it before, because we've got, you've got a new series that's starting soon on Gnostic with our friend, Mike, Rocker Mike, yeah. who he's going to do more true crime, but the way that he looks at it, he looks at it from such, such a spiritual perspective, which I think he's a fabulous storyteller. He's on my channel all the time. And he was telling me that him and his partner are going to sit down and film their first episode, I think this week. So I'm super excited to see what they do on Gnostic because they go really deep. If you guys know the Son of Sam Chronicles, they did where they got into the esoteric um, side of, of these, these situations that we have in our world. And um, they were worried about you YouTube because of of the the you know we, we can't say certain words and so the fact right. that they're able to do that on Gnostic as well and bring another element of entertainment or information whatever you want to call it where we see the world in a different way and I I just you know it's great because they're both New Yorkers and so it's great to have that New York accent telling these stories so um so you guys really seriously those the link to Gnostic is in my description box it's always in the description box I would absolutely check it out if you haven't if you haven't checked it out yet. Yeah, definitely for sure. Enjoy it, everybody. And there's me messengers coming on and just kind of see what's there for you. And um, look, have the best life ever. We're entitled to it. Just grab it, take it, you know, do what you want with it and have and do good with it. You know, that's what we're yeah. about. Right? Absolutely. Absolutely. Well, Jay, is there anything else you want to tell our audience before we sign off for the day? Yeah, look forward to this amazing experience that you and I are going to have, Bryce, on holding together these uh, different amazing messengers together. I'm just super excited about that. So, Get excited about that again. If you're ready for that, just reach out. Let's talk and let's see what you want to do and how we can how we can work and fit into your plans. Yeah, it's never too late to 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 restart your life. It's never too late to follow your dreams. And all right, you guys. Well, I will talk to all you guys very soon. Bye, everybody. Thank you, Bryce. No